guys. So today it is exactly one week until we get married, which is just absolutely crazy to me. I don't know what has happened with the time. Um, but I just thought after watching a whole bunch of wedding videos that I would attempt to film a bit of a wedding week vlog um, just so we can look back at it and see what we got up to. And I don't know if you're getting married soon as well, you can, I don't know, get excited. <laughs> That's what I've been doing. I've been watching heaps of like wedding week vlogs or like just any wedding videos really getting into the into the excited mindset <laughs> because as you can tell I am pretty sorry got distracted there I am pretty excited so Tom and I both took the week uh, before our wedding off which is kind of nice we've got some free time just to hang out get any last minute things sorted out uh, most things are like under control but there's a few you know little things here and there and I don't know I've got quite a long list of just like little things I need to do um, and starting off today, we are planning on transporting a whole bunch of things to my parents' house because that's where the wedding is, it's in the garden. Um, and I thought we'd get a sort of jump start on getting everything over there and so we don't have to worry about it too much during the week. Starting off with all these little succulents that I um, have put together. I've actually been growing these since probably the start of the year, January or so. And they are going to just be little bonbonniers on, not bonbonniers, yeah, that's the word, um, to go on the tables. And I don't know, I think they're so cute. Some of them, oh, focus, some of them are kind of nicer than others. I've been growing them from like the leaf, basically propagating them since um, January. So I don't know, I'm proud of my little succulent babies. <laughs> Hopefully people like them. I think they're kind of a cute little addition. And then I'm just going to take these signs over there as well. I've got quite a few of them. I actually made these uh, myself and Tom's dad helped to make the little easels for the signs to stand on. Um, I might actually do a video showing all of these things before I take them to my parents. Maybe I should do that and actually talk through them all because there's quite a few like little DIY things that I did. Um, in this box we've got just a whole bunch of random little things. Look, there's a sneak peek of our menus. <laughs> little pegs for the seating chart which is over here and gifts for the bridesmaids. Actually I think before we transport everything I might try and film a video Hello. of all the like, decor. Oh there's Tom! Of all the decor bits that um, I sort of DIY'd that kind of thing which oh, of course I decided to film a video like right in the week before the wedding but I've got the week off, so hopefully I've got heaps of time. <laughs> and anyway, Tom, are we gonna go get some lunch now? Yeah. Yeah. Off to get some lunch and then come back and film a video, hopefully, and fingers crossed if I get time, and then go take all these things to my parents. Before we go out, I thought I'd just do a quick outfit of the day, because um, I kind of like what I'm wearing. It's very basic, very simple, but um, these jeans are kind of new. I got them in Sydney, um, so yeah. Top is from uh, Marks. It's just a white cotton t-shirt that I've had for ages. Um, my jeans are Insight and I got them from General Pants and my Country Road black ballet flats, black pointed ballet flats. And I'll show you my new necklaces which actually just arrived yesterday and I think they are so beautiful. Um, they're from a brand called YCL Jewels and um, they, they have all these beautiful, really delicate pieces that are designed to be layered together. Uh, so I got two of them. This I think is called the Infinity Choker. Um, if I'm wrong, I'll write the name here. And I can't remember what this necklace is, so I'll write the name down. But um, I just think that they're so delicate and beautiful and just really understated. Um, and I'm kind of into that look at the moment. I tend to buy like a couple of nicer pieces and like not super super fancy but I don't know I'd consider these pretty pretty nice um, for more investment pieces and I just wear them over and over again like I have this necklace from um oh that's the box it's a beautiful packaging that it comes in this necklace from Mimco which I have worn so many times you would have seen it in a lot of videos um but yeah, and that's my little bride-to-be sash from my um, hen party. So yeah, anyway, um, that's just my little outfit of the day and we'll go get some lunch now. So we've got the succulents very carefully balanced on my lap. Tom's here, got his coffee. Very carefully balanced in my hand. <laughs> Are you excited about the wedding? Uh-huh. Can you believe it's only seven days to go? I can and I can't at the same time. 
don't know. It's just crazy. Time's going so fast. I'm so excited that, oh, I'm, I'm really happy that we both took the week off trip. Because I think that would be nice. What was that? Mr. Whippy, back down oh. the Tom just heard a Mr. Whippy. I saw it. Oh, Tom just saw a Mr. Whippy ice cream fan. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know, it should be fun. And I think, it, like, this week should be, we a bit busy, but not too stressful because we've got most things sorted. Just final last minute things. You need to organize and order the alcohol. Leave you into the last minute. But that was the task that I allocated to Tom. And I'm not stressing about it because he'll get it done. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so we're at my parents' place and these are all the jars that we've been slowly collecting. Hopefully there's enough. We're going to be doing like other arrangements too, but yeah. And some of the succulents are tucked away over here. We're bringing them in batches so that I can hold them on my lap <laughs> each time. So we're at my parents' place and the garden is looking lovely. And my mum has got a whole bunch of these hydrangeas which we're going to pop into those big green pots over there if you can see them. And she's been busy planting things in the little garden beds. The, the mint is going wild <laughs> at the moment. And there's little succulents over here. And yeah, lunch on the veranda. My dad said don't put him on the internet. Can I put you on the internet? Say hello. <laughs> um, so yeah. Yeah. There's apparently some pink hydrangeas over here. They're beautiful. Pretty small little things, but so pretty. The colour is totally washed out. They're really vibrant pink. We just found out that it's going to be about 29 degrees on Saturday, uh, next Saturday, for the wedding, which I'm really excited about. I know it's probably going to be a bit warm, but I'd rather it be warm than cold because it's outside. And I'm actually standing at the moment where Tom and I, right where Tom and I are going to be sitting. So right in the middle here of the path. And then there's going to be tables all along here. And then all along there as well. <laughs> And the speeches are supposed to be there, but we're having a debate about whether we should move it because not everyone will be able to see. So the police are just here to order beer, and I'm just looking at the pretty labels. How pretty is that label? It's not focusing. How pretty is that label? I finally finished filming my videos. It took a lot longer than I thought. I was using a different camera and um, getting it to get the setup right was pretty tricky. So hopefully those videos turn out okay. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna leave the vlog here for today. Uh, Tom has gone to his school reunion, school reunion, it's 10 year school reunion. Where is the time going? I don't know, it's crazy. Um, and I'm just gonna try and tidy up all of the mess that I made here while I was filming and get everything back into an order so that tomorrow I can take this all around to my parents' place. <laughs> See ya!